What's going on, soldiers? Hope everybody's doing well. Hope everybody's doing good. It's your boy, Holy Father Mikey, back with the Blue Lock Reaction. Yes, sir. Uh, chapter 254. Last time was a pretty dull chapter, but this time we should be seeing Kunigami get back into action, getting his get back on Shido. Everybody better tee up. Oh, I want to see everybody get a goal low key, man. Let's get right to it. Okay, chapter 254. My model, the world's model. Here we go. Isagi Kunigami Hiyori. Look at this big three right here, man. Fast immune chain, formation change, we got, okay, calm, calm. PXG draws first blood, but the match is far from over. To contain Shido, Noah tweaks Bastard's formation and assigns Kunigami to man mark Shido. Now it's time to see how Bastard Munchen strikes back. Dawara, we're only down one. That's what he said, Dahora? Let's get that goal back, Bastard. I'm stopping the next one, roger that. Ooh, Cook, we're on the same team, but if I'm being honest, I'm not throwing everyone Every time Shido kun scores, am I right? Yeah. Here goes Tokimisa right there and Nanase. To raise our value and survive beyond the Neo Egoist League, we need to we need to do everything we can to help Rin Kun score goals. If we don't make Rin Kun the hero of this match, we're screwed. Yes. If Rin San fails, we fail. Our very lives de our very lives depend on Rin San's success. This guy's a creep. Look at that emoji. What in the hell? Beat it, damn pink bug. Well, 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 looks like Rin Rin over there is jealous of my explosion. I agree. Get out of the way. Ooh, Tokyo Shirisagi! And Kai, look at his four. Bro, this is a crazy four right here, bro. Striker, striker elites. You're an eyesore. Pink haired palette. What do you say? Pink haired. Can I say that? Pink haired. I'm not gonna say that just in case it's like, you know, it's like a slur or something. <laughs> I don't know, bro. That might be a slur or something crazy. I don't know. It's time to turn you into ash. Ooh, cook. Yeah, I'm so popular all of a sudden. Time to party, pink demon style. Recreate. Who the hell is this? Recreate that goal from last time. In theory, it makes sense, but it's not that easy getting into your best performance state. To enter that state, I must predict what everyone else in the field is doing. The flow state he's talking about. My style isn't like Shido's. Unlike him, who is purely focusing on achieving his own ecstasy, I focus on understanding the situation that's currently circling me. <laughs> Wait a minute. Even though the key to victory is to recreate the perfect situation that we can envision, the thought process and triggers necessary to enter top performance varies from person to person. Wait, that means... I see. You can divide top performance into two basic types. Type 1, like Shido's, a type that ignores any super, superfluous outside info and solely focuses on achieving their desires. Type 2, like mine, a type that observes and analyzes the situation and manipulates the world's trigger points to their advantage. Ooh, cook. In other words, an individualistic ego and a holistic ego. I scored a goal, watch me. Watch how I scored the goal. Ooh! Interesting. I like this. Like a yin and yang type of thing. I like it. It's not that one is better than the other. Depending on your personality, it might be that one is better suited to bring out your top performance than the other. Then again, this is just a general generalization I quickly came up with. It makes a lot of sense though, bro. It's mad smart. An indiv indiv individualistic ego prioritizes maximizing the individual self-worth. A model where the individual maximizes his talents by prioritizing whatever they find important or interesting. Okay. Conversely, a holistic ego prioritizes maximizing the person standing in society. A model where the individual maximizes his talents by prioritizing winning achievements and awards that the whole that the world deems important. So kind of like, uh, what's his face? Baro, a little bit. Baro's for sure a holistic one. If I group everyone into two categories... Oh, he's just for everybody. Bachira, Baro, Nagi, and Zantetsu are definitely the indi individualistic type, whereas Karasu, Hiori, Reo, and myself are 100% holistic types. Interesting. Interesting. Since Kaiser is obsessed about trophies and results, is he a holistic type? What about Charles? Which type is Kunigami? No, wait. What about Rin? Damn it, I don't know. I need to analyze this stuff more to better understand this. To reach my top performance, I need to metadata what's happening on the field while figuring out everyone's ego type. I need to gather more intel, input more info, clean clean every aspect, or glean every speck of information I can, all for the sake of achieving my best. That's crazy. There go Ness and Zantetsu. Got you, Ness. <laughs> Ball still in play, moron. Thanks for the meal. Yo, ever since Hiyori awakened his ego, he's kind of tough, bro. He's kind of tough. Bastard. That Kyoto bro, I was waiting for that. Let's do this. If we're gonna reproduce that goal, then I can't simply pass to Isaki-kun. I need to produce my image of myself as the world's best player, and cross it with... Not bad, Monsieur Sian. Monsieur Sian? He's French. 
That's some good eyes you have. He's poking him in the face. This guy, he knew I was gonna pick off the loose ball? Crap, don't let him pass the ball. Charles can also use Metavision, damn it. Before I can clash and cross with Isagi-kun, I have to take down this annoying brat first. Charles is kinda fucking nutty, bro, I'm not gonna lie. He, look at that pass, he's nutty as shit. Oh, yo, 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 you're terrific, little Charles. It's been a while. Explosive demon! <laughs> look at Cootie got me, my goat! Ichi goat, Ichi goat! Oh my god. Ah? Huh? Don't I even know you? I'm that worthless. Loser hero who got his life destroyed because of you! Alright, nice one, Kunigami! Oh my, impressive! My top performance, my top performance will happen after. Oh, whoa. I surpassed him! Come on, Kunigami! Talk your shit! Talk your shit! Break next week. Damn! The key to victory lies in our hands. Only by winning your matchups can you become the heroes leading your team to victory. So we got, it's like. Isagi versus Rin, Kunigami versus Shido. Oh, we got a straight up ISO ball, bro. It's kind of heat. Nah, bro. That's a pretty good chapter. I mean, nothing really happened. I mean, it probably went like one or two minutes in the game, but that was a lot of info. I like how Isagi, uh, what's it called? He 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 he, he kind of characterized everybody into in two like subgroups of like their egos. That's very cool. And I'm very excited to see Kunigami get his get back. Everybody getting their shine in this match. I hope. I hope. I want to see a. What's his name? The the monk dude, the little ball dude. dude I want to see him do something, bro. Cause I, he had a little he had a little moment of like realization before the game. I want to see him sub in and like tee up somehow, bro. Get a penalty kick or something. I don't know. Oh man, good chapter, good chapter, calm chapter. Well, I will see y'all in two weeks for chapter two five five. Hope y'all enjoyed. Make sure y'all stay safe, stay blessed, feed y'all souls as always. And of course, I love each and every one of you. This has been Holy Father Mikey with Blue Lock Chapter 254. Hope you enjoyed. I will see y'all next time, man. Peace out.